for being here. Um, I think the whole idea of privacy, there is none these days. Every day we do stories on what's been hacked and, and all the rest of it. I get the feeling Facebook has no control over all of the massive data and information it has on us at all. What would you say? So there's, to, to some degree, that is correct. They do have a, a decent amount of control of information, but we're kind of past that point anyway. Um, the, the real question of what his pivot was is, can I now create a separately a second business that's very focused on private conversation? As he called it, the living room. The town squares, as we know them to be, mm. the Instagram, the Facebook, those properties that generate the advertising revenues will stay the same. He's now trying to say, I've seen that there's been a retreat because it, it's a platform where you just go in there, you share with your friends you like. Mm -hmm. Most people watch. They don't really contribute to it. But if you and I were having a private conversation, we'd feel much more free to have a conversation. If he, if he can create that situation, there's a lot of revenue to unlock. Well, well, that's the big if. I mean, can they create such an encrypted system where, where even Facebook can't get into it? <laughs> so, yes, it's not a matter of their ability to create an encrypted system, but saying encryption is, is like a buzzword for him at the moment. It's not what the users need to feel. They breach so much trust that they need to now message and tell people this is safe. And what he said was there's a key term called interoperability, where he wants to get WhatsApp, Facebook, and Instagram all speaking to one another so you could fluidly move. My prediction is at the beginning of Facebook, people told him make money, start selling advertising. He waited a very long time till he reached real scale to make money. The plan he here is he's going to get people into this private world, mm. work very hard through advertising, communication mm. functions to get it happening. And then I think the future of the internet is in micropayments. You want to watch an article, you want to watch a clip, you want to do these things, you'll be able to transact there. And if you create a secure environment, you can now sell to one another. So you're saying, do we have to pay to be in this private living room? Is that part of the model or not? Absolutely. I don't know if people would. Maybe. No, absolutely. I agree with you. I don't think anyone's going to pay. Yeah. And if you study anything about millennials and the next generation, <laughs> they don't really, they'll, they'll pay for quality if it's there. I think more importantly, like a retailer, there might be a, a percentage he takes upon transactions, but none of this is going to happen until he creates a safe environment. And that's what he says he's going to do. He says, this is the future of Facebook. But the old Facebook, the cash cow, where all the advertising go yeah. dollars go, is not going to change. That is Facebook. That is Instagram. It's more the WhatsApp, the I message world that Apple has. That's what they're going to really work on. And you don't think advertisers are turned off by this? Advertisers still can go play in Instagram and Facebook. People will still okay. play there. Instagram's turned into um, a magazine that people love to flip right. through, but that doesn't mean everyone's contributing to it. So the point right. is, it's a great place, and you have your influencers that are posting and viewing and creating content. It's essentially the future of cable television in that respect. Mm. So there's a lot of viewers. He wants interactions, and interactions need to happen in guarded environments. So it's a real question of, can he do the execution? Yes, I do think he could pull off the execution. Is he going to get people to really then switch there and then be able to start dosing out right. the ability to do the little the little things that, that make it that way? We'll see. Well, it, investors are not totally convinced this morning. Stock down about two-thirds of one percent. Ian, wish and grab. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thank you for Very having me. Very interesting topic. Very interesting.